It's beyond what most Kentuckians could have even asked for. One of the largest music festivals in the state wrapped up today with headliners including the Doobie Brothers and hometown legend Chris Stapleton. Bourbon and Beyond reports that the Commonwealth Economics calculated that the fourth day festival is expected to generate $19. million. In 2021, more than 14,000 hotel rooms were booked. The festival promotes more than just artists and bourbon. This year, a mental health nonprofit was personally invited to be a vendor by the festival's owner, a push to spread a message of hope. So there's so much stigma around mental health and people talking about it. So we do, and we work with Danny Wimmer quite a bit, and we do all of his events all over the country. And we just try to come out, meet people where they are, and start the conversation and just kind of end the stigma around mental health. We provide hope and help for people struggling with things like addiction, depression, self-injury, and suicide. And so our biggest resources are Find Help Tools. So you can go to www.twaloha.com slash find dash help and put in your zip code the criteria you're looking for, whether it's a counselor, a treatment center, or even just a peer support group, and it'll give you free and low-cost resources specifically in your area. And if you're looking for more action, the Louder Than Life Festival kicks off next week. Headliners include the Red Hot Chili Peppers. That event is expected to generate close to $25 million for the state.